Alright, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Risen Kingdom. I have no idea what this game is, apart from the fact that it looked kind of neat. I haven't played a whole lot of RTSs and in, like, a while, and I just, I don't know, I want to try stuff. Uh, let's see, do we do the tutorial? I guess we should. Alright, medium. This mission you'll learn the basics of resource management, how to defend your camp and fight neutral monsters. So it looks like it's one part town builder, one part, like, uh, survival. And that sounds exciting. Sometime long ago, these lands were part of the kingdom, but everything changed one fateful day as hordes of undead arrived seemingly out of nowhere, destroying everything in their path. Ready to flee, some families survived, but all of this is in the past now. Everything will change soon, as today we begin our conquest. We shall destroy the evil and rebuild our kingdom. Okay, welcome! Building menu is at the bottom of the screen. So, uh, people of Foundation of Any Kingdom, build a house. Cool. Well done. People consume food. Let's make a windmill. Food shortages may cause famine. Build a sawmill. What is used for building and maintaining structures? In the resource menu, you can see your income and expenses. Structures can be can both bring and consume resources. For example, houses bring in gold while requiring wood for maintenance. Build a barracks. That's not a barracks. There's a barracks. Time to raise an army. Select the barracks. Pick swordsman. Train two swordsmen. Travel east. Kill a goblin. Okay, there we go. So this is like... Somebody saw Warcraft 3 and their billions and decided to make an RTS with Flash. You know, I honestly can't complain too much. I, It's a simple style, but it looks nice. Killing neutral monsters will give you gold. Prepare your defenses. Stake walls. Look at po posts. Oh, good. My units do heal just slightly. Basic defensive structures are ready. Now we need more warriors. Increase the size of your army. We need more population. So, get some houses. Uh, let's see. Get some more swordsmen. And some archers. Okay, probably shouldn't put that outside. At least the archers on the lookout posts. Archers on lookout posts have longer range and higher damage. The unta undead attack. Defend yourself. Okay, so we can see building maintenance, consumption. Oh, okay. Well, I guess it won't let me build any more than I already have. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, only one archer per tower. I guess we're just going to go bananas with them later. Well... I've already gotten glassy-eyed. Probably should have split my dudes up a little bit more. Well, do I have any kind of repair? Or maybe structures just repair on their own. They attacked from the south, my lord. And they are dead. We fought them off. Repair the damage building. So that's how we repair stuff. So it looks like things don't actually get destroyed. Okay, speed up the process. Yeah, they don't get destroyed, but you do have to repair them. Settlement has recovered. Research spoils of war at the castle. Okay. 20% more gold for killing neutral monsters. Let's see. Yep. Forget that much. Destroy the enemy in the south. Whatever. Can I hire some people? Cool. Heavy shields. <laughs> Can I just... Play freely? No, I cannot play freely. And I should get some water. Okay. So, do I need to care this much? I actually have no idea if this is particularly necessary, but still. I do like the idea of, like, one part, um, like, town manager, RT RTS, whatever. One part, like, that's not, uh, I guess that is kind of southeast. Yeah, it's kind of southeast. I'd say that's just directly east. Um... But, like, I really liked their Billions. I just found it to be a little bit 
slow. Like, you were kind of sp spending half of your time just in- Woo, boy. Okay. So mushrooms are deadly. I guess I'm just not going to- I'll just have these guys hang out in town. We're just going to ignore for the time being. Uh... Well, like, Thera Billions was very much just, like, a super turtle simulator, and there wasn't a whole lot of, like, adventuring out to do in the world apart from, like, clearing things out. Which, I guess, worked, but I wanted a little bit more from it. Like, really obscene... <sighs> I want Total Annihilation crossed with Thera Billions, because that would be amazing. Upgrade your castle. So that increases our pop cap. You need to heal faster outside of combat, fully reveals the map. Increases wood production by 12%. Okay, build a quarry near the rock... Rock deposits. Oh. I need more houses. I could have figured this out on my own to at least some small degree. Okay. So can I just... Go bananas on these? How's my food? My food's not doing so hot. Okay. So maybe, maybe I screwed up. As we seem to desperately need a smidge more food than I actually have available. Well, uh, let's see. I can, de I can destroy one of those at the very least. Cool. I guess we can increase that production, but we need the quarry first. Okay, and we can get another... Do we want another sawmill? I don't actually... I mean, we've got thousands, so I guess I don't don't really need that. Let's see, increases wood production. Well, that's only going to cost wood and gold, which we have plenty. There's an upgrade to improve the farm. Not currently, except for maybe through the castle. Okay. Music is definitely a little bit on the super generic side. Okay, let's get one of those. Population is too small. Well, never mind. Map is complete. Oh. So we have some orcs and some other things. Build more stake walls. That's fair. See how long? Ooh, ten seconds. Now, how many of these stake walls can I put down? Is there a limit? Is there? Okay, the upper limit is I can only put it on grass. Got it. Right, what else can I get? Increase food production by 67%. I'll take that. Let's see, cannon is a little outside of my price range, at least for now. Anything else I can do? No. Oh, these... This is easy. I really appreciate the fact that the, uh... That the archers have a nearing accuracy. I've played... Altogether, way too much, um... Altogether, way too much... I mean, to some degree, they are billions, but also, like, Kingdom and some other stuff where your archers are just like, pew, and they just hit wherever. I think there's also, like, Kofi Quest and a couple others that... It's like, I liked them, but they were definitely, like, awkward. I was hoping for a little bit more... Oof. Okay, so I can do nothing else. Maybe make a cannon, but some of my guys have to die. So in that case... We're just going to... accept casualties. Okay. It 
I'm gonna put that there. Hopefully that's got enough oomph to do what I need it to do. The Kofi quest was something. The friendly fire was unfriendly. It's, I liked it, but there were small problems. It was also just very slow. I have beefs with like really slow, slow games. Okay, can I get another cannon? Hell yeah, I can get another cannon. Build it up here. Okay. Not that I have a whole lot of worries. But yeah, I'm gonna stand by my, my statement of like, I really, really would adore a total anni total annihilation cross with um with like base defense and town builder where you just have ridiculous like upper end tech that just demolishes anything uh in your way but only if you've like spent enough time and money on on the requisite research never really seen that Actually, just the cross between RTS and Tower Defense, it's weird, because they've always been, like, paired off. But I've never really seen, like, a particularly exciting one. Complete the mission on a higher difficulty. I don't care about stars. That's mobile game stuff. I feel like those stake walls aren't actually doing anything. Yeah. Yeah. The first victory came easy to us, but there was little time to celebrate. We've set up a new camp at a clearing between two lakes. If we strengthen our defenses, we'll be able to control the area for the foreseeable future. Okay, so castle's upgraded. We got some stuff. Main beef, what is this? Fountain, increase the rate at which you obtain research points by five per minute, that's good. I'm just gonna plonk that there. So markets can trade resources and the rest are not available. We have lookout posts, we got stake walls. We've got quarry, mill, sawmill, the usual. Stone houses accommodates five people and brings in eight gold. It requires five. Still worth it. Fighting under the sunlight before, but the undead usually start at, uh, strike at night. Okay, I do have a barracks, but I don't have... Oh, I see. Besides, your ranged units occasionally miss in the dark. You need, to f you need fire to fight off the undead during the night. Build a few bonfires. Oh. Okay, and some torches. Torch... where? It doesn't seem to care too much. Enemy comes from the west. Defend yourself. Okay, nope. Still can't get any more archers. Well... I guess we're still stuck in tutorial land. Okay, let's take a look. So we have some other upgrades, maybe. So, double chev chevron just upgrades the barracks. Let's see, bonfires keep burning during the day, healing nearby units. Understandable. Hey, choose an upgrade. Wow, this is... This is absolutely... Inspired by their billions, but that's okay. Treasure hunter. Okay, train new warriors. Oh, assassins. So there's more unit types. So we got paladins and assassins. Take a lot of damage. Yep. Neutral monsters are guarding resource deposits. Take control of them, please. Please, game. I've got it. I can figure it out. It's it's okay. You don't need to. My hands. I don't need them to be held. I know this is a game that's probably aimed at children, but like, boy howdy. Alright. Y'all are gonna go kill some... some of that. Alright, set that there. Uh, let's see. Oh, Glaive does a bounce. What? Nope. First, first of all, we must ensure our economic progress. We need a lot of resources. Yes. Yes, we do. Can I, can I have my camera back? Cool. Grab a ricochet. Uh, let's see. So we're gonna want we're gonna want to grab some things. Some oh we we're gonna need some houses. 
Gooses. Okay, next up, I'm gonna need some mills before everything goes bad. Okay, we've milled up. We should probably up our food production immediately. Okay, grab that. Hopefully we don't get attacked from the south. This certainly does not look like the best situation for getting attacked during, uh, from the south. So, sawmill. Sawmill. Any other sawmills? No. But we can get a quarry down. I'm just gonna get a lot of those. Destroying a building? No. Fully reveals the map. And it's heal faster. Well, resources are looking fine, and we've got a fair bit of pop cap to work with. Yeah, we can get another sawmill here. Looks like I lost my paladin. We should probably hang out for a bit and grab some more resources. Uh, let's see, paladins can heal, heal nearby allies. Okay, so I think I'm mostly going to just use... Whoops, I... Uh, gold or mills produce more more food for every every two. Well, now we have madcap food. Let's see. Where else can I jam houses in? Oh, here. The one thing is we don't want to burn too much of that. Okay. Oh. Venus that die near the paladin have a chance of being effect, uh, resurrected. That's actually kind of lovely. I think I might have to destroy... I guess I'm going to destroy two of these. There we go. Perfectly balanced, because I'm not going to be able to get any more than this. Let's see, let's grab that upgrade real quick. Doesn't look like it can up... Oh. So you can upgrade buildings at this point. That's fine. Okay, undead are going to be here in four minutes. Onwards. Okay, so we might want to consider getting a market. I'm going to pick that up early. I'm thinking market's probably the mo- oh. Market's probably one of the better things that I can have access to. Because I'm going to need more of some than others. Okay, let's just get a bunch of those out. Uh, let's see. Reveal the map? I guess it will. It doesn't cost too much. So, I can buy food. I don't know if we need to buy food. We just have so much... We have so much gold. Okay, we don't have so much gold anymore. But that's okay. So what else can I upgrade? Got cannon towers. We got some other things. I'm curious what they meant by research towers. I do control groups? Doesn't look like it. Okay, there we go. So far, so good. Uh, let's see, swordsman health or archer damage? Obviously, archer damage. Oh, maybe the research is the upgrades. That's probably it, actually. Oh, there goes my assassin. Whatever.
Oh, I can't build another. This mission. Okay. Optional objective done. That's good. Alright, so we gotta get some defenses. And I'm not entirely sure if they'll be attacking from any of the other angles. I certainly hope not. Okay. Get him. So there's a shooty boy. I'll keep that in mind. Okay, so they attacked from the south. I think it might have actually been marked on the map. Yeah, there's an opening south of the castle. Doesn't look, doesn't look like they went that direction, though. We survived the first wave, but there's no time to rest. To fight our future attacks, we must strengthen our defense. Alright. Repair all. How expensive are these? Actually, pretty expensive. Right, fortify all roads leading to the castle. Where would the mini map go? Eh, right, whatever. Maybe he wants more lookout posts. Okay, heavy shields and double shot up upgrades. Oh, I guess I'll pick that up then. And upgrade those. Oh, does that upgrade them into stone houses? Probably. Nope, need more wood. Luckily, there's no real economy here. It's just like even keel across the board. Okay, let's put archers in every single one of these. Need some more cannons. I'm preferential to putting my cannons in places where they can kind of hit everything. Also, wow, cannons are expensive. Alright, research points accumulate faster. Yeah, so this is this is research level. I get it. I like that. Okay, so we are technically well equipped. I am unsure what I want to spec into. My assumption is archers. And more archers. So we're just going to get a bunch of archers. The town needs a mayor. I'm I'm fine with this. I, I know people always get a little itchy when it comes to, like, games that are very clearly aping off of other ones. But, like, I do actually really appreciate the um, learning from example, I guess, would be the best way to describe it. Sell a bunch of stone. I have so much of it. I don't even know what to do with all of it. Okay, do we want yet more cannons? Okay. I, I guess we're just golden. Oh, well, this is easy enough. Back back to putting down goofy amounts of steak balls. Oh, we're out of wood. I don't have any more lumber mills that I can pick up, correct? No. Okay, let's uh I'm gonna get a bonfire down next to those guys. Well, that's easy. And never mind, we win. I'm curious what the upper end of the tech tree is. It seems like this might be a little simple. I almost kind of wish this game 
hadn't done these like separate missions and it was instead honestly a lot like uh let's see a lot like their billions where you just like slap down and try and live as long as possible or something like that maybe i'm not entirely sure okay foothills eh. Our kingdom is being rebuilt brick by brick, but if we are to continue, we need powerful allies. We need must seek the support of the Ice Peak Dwarves and crush the enemy. Set up a base at the foot of the mountain ridge, but before we proceed, we must make sure our rear is well defended. Butch plates for all. Charge. This is mine. Uh, let's see, do we upgrade it? We barely have anything, so yes. Let's see, what else can I build in the meantime? I'd like wells, but I guess we're going to need quarries. Oh. I don't get those until castle level 2. Good to know. Hey, there's a survival mode on the level select screen. Okay, so when we finish this mission, then we can do the survival mode for a little while. just a stack up nonsense amounts of archers. It just works better. Wonk. I guess I should probably send the archers to come help. There we go, that's some resources. Alright, this is our land. Jerks. Oh! Okay, those guys are... Those guys are Danger... Dangerbus. Hear them, apparently. Uh, let's see. I guess we should probably... We should probably slap down some resource generation. We need sawmills. Oh, but I don't have enough people. Oh, that's gonna be mine again so yeah it seems like once I take the flags then everything kind of becomes mine grab that we're gonna yep extra wood or more of the resource okay and we need a mill but we don't have wood now we have wood Okay, I'm just gonna slap that there. I don't know where I get to put my defenses down, but apparently we get to put them down somewhere. Presumably the undead are gonna come either this way. No, they're not gonna come that way. They're gonna come from one of these locations. So in that case, we might wanna pick up two of these guys. Just to be sure. Because I don't know where the undead are coming from. And that's obviously a bad thing. Okay, so they're coming from the top and the side. Mill. Okay, at least the farm is a little bit more durable. Okay. Starters still can't do that. Alright. Get 
There was what the oh. We have a fam what? Why did all my houses simultaneously break? Stone tr oh because stone houses. I get you. I didn't even think about that. I wish it showed the up upkeep costs here, but it makes sense. Yeah, you gotta have stone to actually even make them. Okay, can't feed this many people. Well, at least it warns me. Oh, right. Should probably repair everything. All right, so what do we have up here? Did... No. What? Oh, gold? No. Food. Yes. Damn. That guy's got, uh, big magic. Okay, so let's load up real quick. What else do we have here? Nothing particularly useful. Uh, let's see. I still haven't made the quarry. Okay, looks like this area is done. So they will be coming from the north. Uh, let's see. I don't actually want to demolish that yet. We honestly want to keep expanding a little bit. Okay, there's the quarry. Can I get the farm down? Yes. Okay, farm's down. What else have we got? Anybody else? How long do I have? Okay, so I've actually got three minutes before I get hit again, which is good. So I'm just going to send these guys around for a little bit. Uh, let's see. Let me get the double arrow upgrade. Seeing as we're actually sitting pretty high and dry wood-wise, we'll leave these guys alone for a bit. Uh, let's see. Let's let's focus on domestic issues. Let's increase stone production and wood production. We're going to need both of those. Okay, stone stone production is starting to go up. Oh, I should have just put all my houses down here. Because, yeah, I can probably fit at least one more farm right up in there. Okay. Get the weed upgrade. Would like to. Can't afford it yet. Let's see, what are we going to get next? Oh, so he already has that upgrade. Okay, that's good. Can I get the freaking wells? Yes. I guess I can put them down here. Nothing's ever going to attack from the lower section, so I don't have to worry about as much. Uh, let's see. Is it smart? Oh, we need more stone. So I'm just going to I'm just going to jam all these things down and around in here. Uh, let's see. So let's dismantle these. I've got a minute. Yep. Archer damage. So it looks like maybe some of the leveling perks are kind of the same no matter what. The night is coming without fire. It may be our last one. Let's make a fire and set up a few torches. Okay, I have no money. Okay. Uh, 
let's see. Luckily, I've got a goofy amount of wood. Okay. Looks like they're attacking from both directions. Can I get this down? No. Okay. I need at least a couple of you guys up here. Oh boy. Go for that. You guys got this. Thank you, Healy boy. Okay. We lost some. We're good. So we need more paladins, obviously. We need a lot of things. We need money. Money's our biggest issue. Which means we need... We need wheat. We need wheat and we need taxes. I guess what I could do... Okay, let's upgrade those. I had so much more money previously. What is demanding it? The answer is just building maintenance. Yeah, I guess I have a lot of production structures. Well, let's get the market real quick. So I can actually sell some of these things that I might not need. The answer is I actually don't have much that I might not need, which sucks. Right. They can't fire in both of those directions. Build another fountain. I will. As soon as I can. Alright, let's sell stone. There's no way I'm going to be using that much stone. Can't build another fountain in this mission. Okay, that's good. Upgrade the houses. How are we looking food wise? We're looking. Decidedly adequate. Okay, last farm goes there. That should be enough food for more than enough houses. Uh, let's see. And we cleared this area out, so we want to go this way. We need cannons. Gonna need things. Let's reveal the map just to see. Uh, houses bring more gold or research points are faster. Let's go for the houses bring more gold. Faster research points would be nice, but seeing as we're having pofolk problems, maybe I should anti-pofolk problems. Uh, where's my... I guess I do actually have the extra paladins there. Alright. E. Okay, those are expensive, but those aren't so bad. Build not enough gold. Ha! Mage more. Yeah, I'm just going to up my wood production. Worst comes to worst, we just sell it constantly. Same thing with food if I was particularly motivated, but... Eh. Probably better that we just have non-stop houses in that regard, actually. Okay, that's... An adequate army. Charge! Get me those resources. I need them. According to our scouts, a horde of the undead is coming. To fight them off, we'll need a cannon. Okay. Get the cash. Grab the bits. Alright, is that everything? That's everything. So, time to finally start turning this into the defensive horror land that I've always, always dreamed of for the past couple minutes. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, let's see. I guess I could get, like, another couple of farms. Yeah, let's just, let's go bananas with, with farms. The more farms we can get, the more houses we can get. The more houses we can get, the more ridiculous everything becomes. Still don't have enough gold, though. But I have a lot of stone. 
we'll keep like a thousand stone around, but there's the cannons. Okay. Two paladins there. Rest kind of over here. It's a bit haphazard. But I'm not actually sure it really needs to be tremendous. Alright. Structure is built and upgraded faster. Health is increased. No. Units are trained 60% faster. Requires less resources. Uh, let's see. Stake walls are cheaper to repair. Let's go with engineering. Structures having more HP seems like a good idea. Alright. And seeing as we don't have too much else, let's just get archers. Well, minor issue. I underestimated how many enemies would be coming through this direction. The answer is not too many, but enough. Let's see, once, once more swordsmen. Uh, I don't. I don't need them. Let's see, mini wood. Well, our gold's looking a little bit better. Okay, let's let's just jam down an uncomfortable amount of houses. Really make that that gold income sing. Anything else I can actually buy or upgrade? The answer is not overwhelmingly no. Okay, is this the last house? Yep, that's the last house. Solid walls. Maximum, maximum houses. Alright, so I can have 85. Question is, what do I want to get? Answer is cannons. Hopefully we'll have enough resources to just go madcap uh, cannons all over the place. Maybe. I'm on. the other issues. We're going to need a lot more steaks. Well, do we sell some food while we're here, actually? Unfortunately, food is not worth nearly as much as everything else. Well, yeah. I guess we'll get the extra swordsman. Because swordsmen don't require, uh, wood. Everybody else does for some reason. Not swordsmen. I guess I'll pick up the armor thing. Wonder breezes through waves. Wonder needs more defenses. Hell yeah, I do. Oh, that's why you probably need the torches. Torches increase overall accuracy. Well, it's fine. We are we are kicking ass to the nth degree. And cannon? Thank thank cannon. Might not actually get that bonus objective. I guess what we can do is just move these guys back. No, I should do that. Giving the cannon room to breathe is silly. Each shot an ar archer makes is 10% faster than the last one. Hmm. Wooden stone more... or... Arrow rain! Gotta go. Gotta fire fast. 
Oh, shit, it's an evil wizard. Evil wizard is quite dead. That's what you get for standing in arrow range, dingus. Are we, are we done? Are we good? I think we're good. Well, this is a cute little game. Oh, nope. More coming. Yeah, the answer is just non-stop amounts of arrows and spikes. I should probably repair all of my spikes, though I think we just won, so I guess it doesn't matter that much? Well, do we dive into... let's do one quick round on survival and see how that goes. Okay, survival, kingdom. Oh, it's down here. Okay. Yeah, let's do that, because campaign modes, it's okay. It's not bad, but... Yeah. 